Now, an up-close look at artificial intelligence being developed by two local heavy hitters. A team of researchers at Brown University is working with Hasbro to make an intelligent robotic companion that would help senior citizens, especially those with mild dementia. Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian got a rare access to both Hasbro's model shop and the Brown Robotics Lab to find out more about the technology and when it could hit store shelves. She joins us now with what she's learned new tonight. Well, you can already buy these animatronics from Hasbro for about $100, but researchers hope that in a few years, the lifelike cats and dogs will have even more to offer to an older crowd than Hasbro is used to catering to. Recognize this guy? The original Hasbro animatronic, the 1990s Furby, paved the way for this. The joy for all cats and dogs are geared specifically towards seniors. Hasbro's Ted Fisher says their prototype testing room is normally reserved for kids, but not this time. We brought uh, a group of seniors into our fun lab. It was about 30 walkers and you know wheelchairs in it. And so it was a very different audience and it was as much fun, if not more fun. Now armed with a $1 million National Science Foundation grant, Brown is teaming with Hasbro to turn these cuddly toys into highly advanced pieces of artificial intelligence. So our idea was we can bring expertise for the artificial intelligence, for the mechanics and the human robot interaction side. And they are one of the best companies to build at a very small scale and an affordable scale, something that can really be distributed to a lot of people. We were neophytes in this space, in this aging and senior space, but, you know, Brown and, and Brown Medical have an incredible geriatrics department, those type of things. The project is called ARIES, or Affordable Robotic Intelligence for Elderly Support. Brown professor Bertram Male says the cat or dog would contain a tiny processor and sensors for sight, sound, and touch, not only to interact with their user, but to log information and do things like help dementia patients remember what they otherwise might forget. It reminds the person, might point towards the medication box that the person hadn't thought of. Inside the Hasbro Model Shop, Director of Model Development Patrick Marr shows the inner workings of their creations, from eyes and skeletons to the motherboards that power them. While just a few miles away at Brown's Labs, they're working on the cutting-edge technology to help these toys one day communicate with users, smartphones, and computers. What I think Hasbro brings to the table, and layer that with what Brown has also meant to our local community, but doing it together to have broader global impact, uh, hugely powerful and super exciting. And this project is expected to take three years. Brown hopes to have a working prototype by next summer and to test the product with actual seniors by year two. Once the product is finished, it will be up to Hasbro if and when it will be on store shelves. I'm Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News.